Hi everyone, I'm Mike Gualtieri, Principal Analyst at Forrester Research. I cover big data and advanced analytics. Today I want to talk to you about the process of using machine learning algorithms to find predictive models. Now finding predictive models is no easy task, so I'm going to break it down for you into six steps. Step one is to understand the data. The modern enterprise can have a portfolio of hundreds of different applications, all of which generate data that may be relevant to your analysis. Customer data, transactions, increasingly IoT data, social media data, and other operational sources. Step two is to prepare a single analytical data set. Those sources that you identified in step one have to be brought together, linked, transformed, enriched, and potentially reformatted into a single analytical data set. Step three is the modeling process. This is the fun part because this is where you get to run machine learning algorithms on that data looking for patterns and predictive variables in that model. Step four is to evaluate the model. The machine learning algorithms might find a model, but it may not be accurate, or it may not be accurate enough for your needs. Predictive models are not about certainties, they're about probabilities. So you may need an accuracy of 61%, 70%, 88%. It depends upon your application. The evaluation process will tell you if you found a model that you can actually use in your organization. Step five, if you're lucky enough to find a model, is to deploy that model. Models are typically deployed in other analytical applications or in applications themselves. Step six is to monitor the effectiveness of that model. Uh, predictive models can go out of whack for various reasons. Uh, the circumstances may change in the environment where you have to start the modeling process all over again. So those are the six steps of using machine learning to find a predictive model. I'm Mike Walteri, Forrester Research. Oh yeah!